Jared Polin, Fro Knows Photo.com. I'm here with the Urban Disguise 35 from Think Tank. And now I needed a bag to go to Utah with. And I took my airport security, because I packed clothes in there, and I wanted to take my retrospective 30 to shoot out of when I got to Utah. But I would have had to check a bag because I didn't have room for three bags and I really didn't want to check a bag and have to wait and do all of that. So I decided to pick up this Urban Disguise 35 as a way to travel with gear and I didn't know if I was going to shoot out of it. And the big question I had was, could I fit the Hebrew Trinity in it along with a laptop, along with an iPad and accessories so that I could shoot with it at the event? And unbelievably, yes, it actually fits the Hebrew Trinity with everything I mentioned and becomes a really, really amazing bag to shoot out of. And at the time, you saw me walk in here, I have the back strap uh, to turn this into a backpack, which I'll show you how that works soon, but I didn't have it with me then yet. So I'm going to get into the bag, I'll get to the strap later, and I'm going to take out everything that I have in here and show you how it works. So in here, I have the Hebrew Trinity with the D3S. So here we go, D3S, 24 to 72.8, 14 to 24, 2.8, and the 70 to 200, 2.8. On top of that, you have an iPad, and back here in this compartment, you have your 13-inch MacBook Pro. So this is only if you have a 13-inch MacBook Pro or a 13-inch computer or smaller. That is the max laptop size that will fit in there. But being that I have a 13-inch MacBook Pro, this is a perfect grab-and-go bag. I've learned that I can shoot out of it and just basically take it with me and be the one bag and have like a mobile office. To have an iPad, to have a MacBook Pro, to have the Hebrew Trinity, and then room for accessories and cards. In this case, I've got some patches in here. Uh, I have a patch sewn to the bag right here. You have an extra pouch here for pens, paper, uh, and anything else you want to have. I've got some hair picks and some emergency. Um, but to have a mobile office bag, just a bag that you can take with you. Like if I go to New York and I want to take one bag, I'm going to take this bag, I'm going to put the camera in there, I'm going to put the computer in there, the MacBook Pro, sorry, the MacBook Pro and the iPad, and then even a mobile internet device. So really, this bag is like the, it's a great bag. To have one bag that I can put all of this stuff into and travel with and shoot out of and then even turn it into a backpack. So this is what you do here. You take this strap here, you snap that in, you slide this strap under, pull it through, then connect it to its connector right here, snaps in, boom, it's connected. And even at the bottom here is where you hook the back straps up to your bag. So really, this is, this is a solid bag. I was really happy and really surprised to find out that I could shoot out of this bag on a photo shoot as well as have all of this other stuff that I carried on with me to a plane. Batteries, memory cards, the Hebrew Trinity, D3S, MacBook Pro, iPad, and other accessories. And now with the back, back strap, this is a grab and go bag that I'll take with me anywhere I go because it can go with me in the car, get out of the car, get, shoo bug, shoo. So I can get out of the car and have everything I want with me. If I want to shoot, if I want to update the website, mobile internet, boom, you got it all. So that is the Urban Disguise 35 with the additional back strap. I don't even know what they call this thing. They call it the shoulder harness version 2. Really happy with that. Overall, very happy with this setup. Jared Polin, froknowsphoto.com. See ya.